My name is Sarah Simon and I'm the Mint Gardener. I'm an artist and an author and I live on a small urban farm full of chickens and vegetables and flowers in Seattle, Washington. I've always been a beauty seeker at heart. I grew up hungry for it. I spent summers playing hide and seek with my cousins in the sky high sunflowers that my grandfather planted every year. And I loved to draw, to paint, to create, to make something tactile with my hands and translate the beauty that I've been seeing all around me onto my paper into art that I can share with people I love. My husband and partner in life, Colin, and I have a garden of our own in Seattle now, and our two small daughters love to be out there with us. It's become a place for us all to be together. We love to plant everything, tomatoes and squash, corn and beans, and of course, flowers, always flowers. My passion for painting and sharing this beauty that I seek has been the most natural way to express myself that I've ever found. Watercolor is the way I share. Painting pictures is the tool I was given to show people love. I have the pleasure of painting and teaching watercolor and I'm so thankful for the community that these have given me over the past few years. Uh, connection and accessibility are my two main considerations when it comes to teaching people how to paint. So these were big considerations as I wrote my book and continue to be as I share my love of painting. I want you to connect with yourself and your community using art as a way of showing your love. To be able to do this, all you really need are some basic tools. No, you don't really need a $20 paintbrush. You can do it with a $3 paintbrush. Painting pellets, meh. If you don't have one at home already, just use a dinner plate. You just need a few key tools and you're off. I want you to enjoy the process and not fuss about the other stuff. I want you to see how much beauty you can create with minimum expense. I want you to feel the satisfaction of mixing some gorgeous colors with some pretty paints and brushes on a leftover dinner plate. I want you to experience the simple joys of painting. My book and the painting kits are designed to build your skills slowly and steadily. Just remember to be gentle with yourself as you create. I want watercolor to be accessible and my aim is to take any intimidation out of the process so you can feel comfortable just to play and create. Again, hello and I'm so thrilled to meet you through this wonderful medium of social media. I want my books and curated collection of supplies and art to just give you a taste of the mindful habit of sustainable creativity, one that can grow and grow. My book and my art pieces come from my heart and my hands. Welcome. I'm so looking forward to connecting with you. Why is the rose tutorial special to me? I think the first thing I got to actually work with Sarah Simon to develop a tutorial where she shows you how to paint the duplet paper in a special way that I think a lot of artists, especially paper florists, they never get a chance to really know the right technique. And I feel like Sarah with her expertise, she's able to show you the right and the most creative way to use our paper in a different way that we've never thought about. And another reason why the rose is so special is I just love garden roses. The way they smell, I wish we could just capture that, but just visually um, being able to create a rose, you know, blooming your hand, that is so special. And it's so much fun just making paper flowers and I just absolutely love it. <laughs>